Hi, sorry to bother you. I need help with food, especially pads. Please, I have two children and their father doesn't take care of them. We haven't eaten in two days, please. Hello. Please write down everything you'll need. I'll try to buy it and deliver them where you are in Johannesburg by Saturday. The latest, if that's okay. No, give me money. I want money. Send it. Mm, all right, then. Hello, everybody. Welcome back to the one, the only, the easiest of the PZs. I'm Cougar. I'm today's narrator. And today we're diving into a slash choosing beggars. Yeah, I'm going to have a good time with this one. A 17-year-old looking for models to practice hair on. But you buy all of the supplies and pay $100 for the privilege. Hmm, yeah, totally, yeah. The photo is not mine, it's just a reference, but I'm 17 and I've been wanting to do hair for a while, and I'm looking for models to do this hairstyle. On for practice, you have to provide hair, and I'll let you know everything you need to get. You will have to pay $100 for the service, exact cash, only I don't have change. Text my number if interested. No, I won't be texting. Write my 457 page ebook for $10. I want content of 457 pages. I want a book with the title Fitness and want it done in one week. My budget is $10. Do you even know how to write online? You broke my brain with that grammar, dude. <clears throat> Hi, I actually do not work for free. Slavery is over. Kindest regards, Eve. One more person asked me for free content. I swear to God, dude. I swear to God. Um, I asked for gold, dude. Dude, really? I gave you free, free reward over here. You know, I think you should just give out real awards. Dude, every reward's real. What are you talking about? Online English tutor slash teacher work from home. A completed bachelor's degree at the time of application. Available to work on weekends as well as weekdays. <sighs> 15... $15 an hour, Canadian. Yeah, no, 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 no. Prices are set within the shop at what blank considers to be a fair price. Shop staff and volunteers are not allowed to barter prices or give discount. So to save embarrassment, do not ask. I need one of these just on my all my social medias 24-7. Your comment has been given the silver award. I want platinum. Your comment has been given the silver award. Pathetic. How to politely say, sorry, I'm not doing that for free. Thanks so much for considering me. Please see here the link to the services and price packages that I offer. Let me know if you have any questions. Number two. This sounds like a great opportunity. Thank you for thinking of me. Are you able to confirm that this is a paid opportunity? Question mark. Number three, I appreciate you for thinking of me for this opportunity. Unfortunately, I'm unable to take on any unpaid projects at the moment, but I will circle back if that changes. Number four, <laughs> thanks for reaching out. I typically charge a flat fee for this kind of advice, so I'm unable to answer this via DM, but I'll drop a link below where you can book a consultation with me. Hmm, mm, see, this, and if someone responds like this, you respect it. Hello, I'm looking for a simple tattoo shop that takes walk-ins to get this small alien tattoo about the size of a quarter. I've called a few and don't really want to pay a base pay of $60 for this. Is there any around here that doesn't have a minimum? I understand why there is a minimum, but just try not to spend a lot for something so small. Heck yeah, fella, come on down to Cougar Stick and Poke. We make you the best tattoos made from ripped in half pans and a crappy needle. Come on down. Results may vary, but heck, it's only $10 and takes us five minutes. <laughs> I once gave my friend a stick and poke and it looks so bad now. Headphones available. Message sent. Yes, it's available. Can you deliver tomorrow? Where are you at? In Detroit West Side. I can try. I have a few things I have to get done tomorrow. Oh, okay. Well, if you can't, let me know now. I'm gonna say I can't then. Frick you, you ugly butt rat faced b dope butt head mental family. Oh my god, why you gotta swear so much, dude? Just stop swearing. Stop swearing. We're trying to read this for easy peasy. 10k fitness sandbag. Manchester, England. Realistic to an absolute spanner, this item is collection only. If you ask me to deliver, the price goes up to 500. No, I will not meet you outside work. And no, 11.30 p.m. on a Sunday night is not an acceptable time to collect. Collection from Fallsworth, $30 O and O. See, this guy's clearly stating his terms. There's nothing wrong with that. I personally will deliver within like 15 miles of my house, but I'm not going to drive to your job and wait for you to come on lunch break. If I do a job in 30 minutes, it's because I spend 10 years learning how to do that in 30 minutes. You owe me for the years, not the minutes. Ah, good business practice right here. We are looking for a site engineer intern to join our company. The following are the requirements. 1BE slash BTEC 2020 pass out. Should be based in black squiggly line. 
online. Should have a laptop slash PC in case work from home. Should have a bike to visit the site. Male candidate is preferred. <laughs> Note, this is not a paid internship. Alright then, just gonna throw this in the trash. Hey girl, hope you're doing good. So, I hope this isn't too much of trouble, but I started this brand blank, a clothing brand, and the username is taken. Is there any way you could change it? Like, just add a number, an extra letter, or something? LOL, it would mean the absolute world to me. I have everything ready to launch soon, and this is the only thing holding me back to post, LOL. Beautiful name, by the way, LOL. How about I pay you $20? I really, really need the name. $30? Anything? Uh, please, girl. You alive? I'll pay you $40. It's your finesta. Help a girl out. Hi. No, thank you. Seriously, LOL? As soon as I get the brand registered, I can legally get the name from you, but all right. We'll just have to wait to register the name then. I'll have my lawyer deal with Instagram. Women supporting women, apparently there's no such thing. Yup, because that's how the law works. You want my name and can just tell your lawyer to give it to you. Uh-huh. My sister-in-law was selling her daughter's toy online. The person was offering one pound in total for the sale of the item and delivery. Hi, is there any chance I can pay just one pound? As I have no money and my family will love this. Uh, yeah, it's just a pound. Are you local or do you need it posting? It would need it posted, however, I can't afford the delivery. I cannot pay. Okay, sorry, I'm not paying the delivery. I wouldn't be making anything. It'd be out of my pocket three quid and it's uh, my daughter selling these items. So, uh, yeah, no. No, not happening. Morrison. This half term, we're donating over 60,000 free homemade pizza kits from our stores to support hunger across the holidays. The kits feature everything kids will need to make their own pizza and will be donated to local schools and community groups to pass on to families in need. Why not try healthier meal options rather than pizza? I don't know, dude, it's a pizza shop, maybe that's why. Target acquires! Take the shot! What about my money? We'll pay you after the job is done. We agreed half now, half later. Okay, honestly, we're on a budget. What? How about exposure? We have Twitter game follower on social media. You're kidding me, right? I already bought the bullets! Legend of Zelda's Link's Awakening. Hello, is this still available? Can you do 30, please? Uh, yes, it's available. I can do 35, but it's pickup only. Friend, this is for a child from Venezuela who asked me to buy it. Please make 30. It is not for me, it is for a child. It is a noble favor, a child who has been saving time to buy games for himself, Nintendo. Please. Uh, sorry buddy, but 35 is more than fair considering what comparable items are going for. Where it's going or who it's going to doesn't involve me. You don't have to say that, you have to have empathy in life. Good deeds are returned to you. Anyway, I will give the child your best offer and let you know if I can buy it. I haven't said anything out of line and honestly at this point I don't think I want to meet up with you for an exchange. Best of luck to you and your friend. You are a rat and good manners. And Zelda game as well, don't forget that. I don't even ignore people like you. What? <laughs> have a great day, bud. I have a game to play. <laughs> and you've got some grammar to learn. Yeah, so looking over wedding day, five hours will not be enough to cover the entire pictures that I'd want. We unfortunately cannot stretch our budget for photography anymore. Um, I wanted to ask if you guys would be willing to stay on an additional three hours for full coverage of the day for free? Yeah, no, but thanks for asking, buddy. Overpriced! $3.99 on Kindle Blah! That's actually below average price for an ebook at the moment, but all of my books are also available in libraries if you prefer. Libraries, if open, would be the last place I'd choose a book for being visually impaired. The Kindle offers an additional solution. Why not try the 99p introductory price? I'd then probably follow you as an author. <sighs> This is my job and my career, Phil. It feeds my family. If you don't value books and $3.99 for a year's work is too much for you, you can borrow Kindle books from the library for free. Oh, that's true. They can. They can do that. Yes, it's available. Can you deliver to me tomorrow? I live in Durant, OK. It says no deliveries on the description. Can't drive. Don't have a truck. This is really starting to piss me off. Bye. Ha 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 ha. Snitch. Yeah, 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 just leave. Just leave. My wife bought me a Range Rover cake for my birthday. Look at this crap. I'm mad as frick. This crap looked like a smart car, a stuff pillow, and even the dumb truck from the movie Cars. Now her and her friends mad because I cursed all of them out. $20 OBO inbox now, or I'm about to throw this crap down the street. Serious offers only, no lowballers. Are you just a jerk? It's the thought that counts. Ever heard of that? 
bro, I'd be spending 20 bucks on that thing. It looks delicious. And you know what? I'd share it with your girlfriend because she's about to dump you. Description. Collection only and payment via bank transfer. Q&A. If you see the item on, it is still available. 2. Not delivering. 3. Payment via bank transfer. 4. No, I will not trade it for vintage collection of taxidermy and hamsters. <laughs> 5. You know the price, I know the price. Do not offer me ridiculous amounts and waste time for both of us. 6. I am sorry if your fourth cousin that you haven't seen 10 years has a cough slash corona slash flu slash broken leg and the only thing that will make him happy will be Xbox for half the price. However, it won't be this particular one. Dude, this guy's crazy. I'd totally legit trade my Xbox for a collection of vintage taxidermy hamsters. That's the steal, man. Welp, please, please, please don't be a choosy beggar who frickin' ends up on this subreddit. You're the most infuriating people in the world to me. Over mildly infuriating. I'm not even kidding. Anyways, thank you all so much for watching. Feel free to like, comment, subscribe if you'd be so inclined. Anyways, have a good day, be good people, and remember, stay safe out there, everyone. The world's real crazy these days.